Hello, coming by to some uh, customers who bought a lot of snake in line. And we just finished the I slipped the coil, so it's the moment to take the blade out. And we want to show you today how we remove the blades and spacer to replace it with new sizes. This we would wooden pad wooden pad created by glue it will correct it here to install it here between the uh, blade and the material coming through under this pad we use these different sizes for different beads and the function of this wood is once the material coming through past the blade it won't turn around the blade it will come straightly out so we put the hook on that and we open the down shaft here go on the other side show you here this is kuru we already open it and we're going to up open this one and then one one will be take it out We install the blade on the shaft based on the size and the spacer. Let me show you here. This is where they make it to cover the thread here. Because if we don't use it, this cover, each sheen and each blade will touch this thread and step by step will destroy the screw. So here we make some cover, we make a big knot. Just use it for install and reinstall the blade. Okay, here. And we have one table here for put the different sizes. Size 30 millimeter, 40 millimeter. Let's see. Let me show you. This is 50, this is 30, and here is the blade 10 millimeter blade we have a 10 millimeter blade 15 millimeter and 20 millimeter blade for different material this line uh, capacity is up to 3 millimeter and the speed is up to 120 meter this is spacer it also has a number on that if I can find you and here we wrote it here the size and the thickness if it's clear it's already a little not clear let me press it here zoom it for you 1.9 millimeter and it's 2 millimeter 2.3 millimeter later i will show you the each uh, different size okay Walker one by one, take it out, put it on the proper place, and you can see based on the different size, we use a different spacer here between the blades up and down. I show you here. Based on requirement size and beads, we make a different spacer. And it's, it needed a really professional worker to assemble this blade on the shaft. This coil just cut in by here by half and half will 
and just getting the edge. So you can see here, just we put the space so no any blade, off and down. But our door, we have a one, two, three, four, five cuts. Now we're going to down shaft. Again, we put the screw, we could power the cover of the screw here. Okay, so put separately. The blade also smoothly put it together here. No any damage. You can see the edge. Small size space so sheen. You can see it's 1.9 millimeter. One point one millimeter, one point two millimeter, one point three, one point four. Each size we have a more than twenty pieces. So once we have we get a different sizes, we can use different spacer to manage the size between the blades. And here is the wooden that we already show you. I explained to you the material coming through between these up and down wooden plates. The main and most important part of the slitting is the slitting shaft and the only job that the work or the slitting manufacturer should do is each day changing the size of the blade and the spacers.